everybody. Welcome back to Larry's Fountain Pen. I'm Larry. This is episode 195. A lot been going on since uh, the other day. Uh, today, uh, the video that we were going to take, uh, we couldn't do it uh, earlier because the camera that we're using doesn't work. It malfunctions. So for right now, we're using this backup camera. So some of you may not like the quality of the sound or the picture. But for now, until something better comes along, then this is what I'm going to have to use. So bear with me, work with me, because this is it, what I have right now. So, now we can go on to our next review. We're going to be reviewing the Hero fountain pen. And here's what I have. I have two of them. And uh, one's black and one's a rose gold, rose color pen. And they come in a little plastic sleeve and I'm just gonna take one off this one right now because they're both identical the same just the colors are different and uh, that's it two pieces now they're both are not uh, filled with ink and I'll explain to you why in a minute so this pen um, let me get the weight on it because I don't have a weight scale is a uh, 30 G's on it. Okay, that's the weight. And uh, when I did the uh, measurements, it was 135 millimeters long. That's capped. Okay, talk a little bit about the pen now. Uh, it's got a, a clip on the barrel. It's not too tight, it's not too loose, so it should be okay. We'll give it a test here. This is a thicker shirt, so will it hold you out? Now, will it go on on this thick shirt? It will, but you have to do a lot of finagling with it. So, you have to hold the clip up and put it on, then it's all right. But on this kind of shirt, maybe on a thinner shirt, pocket shirt, it might work just fine. And it has... Uh, on the top of the finial, it's round with a little, like a little tip on the, right in the middle. That goes kind of like a little dome on top. Maybe we can get a zoom in on that. Show you a little bit. And we'll leave the zoom in for a while on for you. Okay, so here's the clip again. And on the barrel of the... I'm sorry, on the cap, it has Hero written on it. And the number of the Hero is 7036. On the back, it's 7036. Then you have a, another little trim going on here for the band. A gold-plated band around the barrel. And let's go down the barrel. At the very bottom, you have a gold-plated tip on the bottom. Nothing great going on, but... The uh, gold plated goes well with the black. And we'll pull off the cap. And first of all, the question is going to be asked, is it postable? Well, let's see. Yes, it is. It's secured very nicely. Not going to fall off. And inside the cap, let me take a better look with it. There's like a Plastic lining, maybe, inside the cap. So, and here on the nib, it's iridium on the nib, two-tone nib, nice-looking nib, and uh, it doesn't give the size on the nib whatsoever. So there's a nib. And then here's the feed. Nothing really much going on with that. So let's uh, take the barrel off. Comes with a converter. Basic Chinese converter. Nothing great. 
and it's got like a little spring inside of it that's like they have the little balls to uh, help with the ink, break it up and get it flowing. Right there, aggravator. Eh, get the ink going. Mm. So anyway, maybe not all that drama, but does it pull off? Yes, it does. So, we got that straight. We'll put the barrel back on. It's a nice looking color. And I'll show you real quick the rose colored one. Take the sleeve off. And that's the same thing as the one you just saw. The black. Same thing, 70, 36. Everything is identical. Now, the reason they're not inked up is because I'm going to give one of them away. Yep. So, I didn't want to ink them up because I don't want uh, to to uh, get them all used up for nothing. I want the person who wins the you know the pen to uh, to do that to ink it up. But what I can do on the black one, let's say, I'll just dip it in the ink and see how it writes. So let's do that, and uh, we'll put the right down here. I'm going to do some clear Fontaine paper. Get me a sheet going on here. And I'm going to use some uh, cross black ink. One of my favorite inks. And so, let's see how this little jewel writes. Okay, I just dipped it in some uh, black cross ink. One of my favorite black inks. So remember, it's not filled up. I just have it dipped in there. So let's see how it writes. Okay. Well, I'm impressed. Hmm. And we'll do some writing. Lazy dog. So, do a few S's here. And we'll check for wetness. Looks like it's going to be a wet one. On clear Fontaine paper. It's a wet one. Nice one. Nice and smooth. So, it looks great to me. It feels fine in the hand. And, uh, let me post it. Not back heavy or nothing. The grip, plenty enough room for your fingers on the grip. Uh, there's not really a, a step down that you're going to feel anything because the barrel goes right into the grip as you can see right there. Uh, so everything's fine. The, the pen is fine. It writes really well. I like it. So, I'm going to keep one for sure, and I'll give the other away for sure. So, what do y'all think? About the hero. Not a bad little pen, and for the price, uh, you can't beat it. Got a great price. So, I'm pleased with the price. Uh, this was on auction. So, I got it for hardly nothing. And that's hard to believe. So, but then I went and bought the other one. And let me just see, was that on auction? Because I forget. Uh... That was a non-auction, but still, I got that at a great price. Okay. So, if you're looking for a functional pen, these are a dependable pen. It looks like, as far as I know, no, I haven't written with it for any amount of time, just what you've seen. Uh, so, let me know what you think. And before I close right now, uh, I did have a comment earlier 
from one of my viewers saying that uh, when I do giveaways to put my email up on screen so you people can see it and know how to get in touch with me. So my question to all the viewers out there, help me out here, we post everything is always in the description box below the video. All the information about my uh, email is on there, PayPal, Patreon, all of it's on there. So let me know if you don't see it, please let me know so we can see if we can correct whatever's going on with it. I looked it up, my buddy looked it up, we, we see it on there. So, is, is it not being seen on some of you or, or what's going on? I'm, I'm, I'm interested to find out now. Uh, so if you would, check it out. So, this is going to conclude the video on the hero. Nice looking pins. And I'll wash this one out real quick. But again, the uh, converter is not filled, so no problems. Just flushing it out real quick. Uh, hit the like button because that helps me out a lot with YouTube. Um, and uh, leave your comments below. They're always important. And I, I look at all the comments and I try to give back to all I can. Uh, so I guess that's going to complete this one. Uh, so I'll go ahead and get this one ready to upload, guys. And uh, uh, I'll see you soon because on the uh, uh, pin case talk that's coming up tomorrow. So stay tuned. Be safe and don't text and drive. Peace.